Hey y'all, I'm back with the Husqvarna Viking 980. This is the vintage machine I picked up on eBay a while back that's like the one my mom had. So a couple of you have reached out to me regarding threading the machine. So let's look real quick. I'm going to go over what's in the manual, the 980 manual on pages 10 and 11. So if you want to check the manual out later, you can probably find a copy used on eBay or Amazon or SD. So first, let's turn the machine around and look at the back. There are two spool pins here. We're going to use the one closest to the harp, the opening of the machine. Then the thread goes over to the guide on the back from the spool pin to the guide on the back. Now this guide has a slot that you have to kind of go behind and then back up to get it into that slot. So let's kind of take a look at that, how that looks from the front. We're going to put the spool on the spool pin closest to the harp, the opening. That's going to be on the left side now. Get your thread in both hands with just a little bit of tension. And then go behind that guide and come straight back up and pop it in place in that slot. Here's a little close-up of what that looks like. So you're going to go behind the guide and then up into the slot. Bring the thread forward into the right of the tent in between the tension disc, then straight down behind the guide I'm pointing at, and then you want to go straight back up and then to the right of the take up. Then at the top of the take up, there's a slot. You're going to want to put the thread down in the slot and pull forward. Now it's threaded in the take up. Bring the thread straight down. Then at the top of the needle, there's another guide. The opening to that guide is to the left and go in and behind that guide. Now we're not going to thread the needle just yet. We're going to run the thread under the presser foot. There's a slot there in the presser foot, just guide the thread in there. Guide the thread in there. And if it doesn't stay in there, if it pops out like that, just do it again. It'll stay. And then bring the thread under the foot and to the right. And then you want to bring it over just under the Husqvarna Viking logo. There's a little slot. Then there's a little metal guide where the red arrow is here. Pop on your bobbin on the bobbin winder. There's no right or wrong sides on these plastic bobbins. Turn your machine on. Then you're going to want to take, after you get the machine on, that loose thread that's in the guide, run it underneath the bobbin counterclockwise two or three times, okay? Then grab the tail of that, the end, Run it under your thread cutter, hold it with your fingers, just a little bit of tension. Now, put your foot on the foot pedal and activate your foot pedal. This starts the bobbin winder. Now, my needle went up and down a few times, so I probably need adjustment on my machine. Just keep mashing your foot pedal evenly. That bobbin will stop winding automatically when it's full. So just as soon as it's full, it stops. You can take the bobbin off. Trim your thread either using the thread cutter or some snips. So now your bobbin's loaded. So let's look. Now that you have thread on your bobbin, let's put it in the bobbin case. Now let's talk about this. You're going to want to hold the bobbin case where the opening is towards you. So the opening towards you, grab your bobbin. You want to insert it correctly. And in this case with the 980, that thread is going to go over the top of the bobbin to the right like this. So the tail to the right. Now put that in the bobbin case just like that. Now your thread tail is going to go through the slot to pull it to the right and then up over and behind that tension spring. Okay, to so double check yourself, we're going to make sure that the bobbin's going to go clockwise when you pull this little thread. So the bobbin, when you pull the thread tail, it should go clockwise. Now, 
Let's open our accessory tray, open the bobbin case door, and let's insert this bobbin. So it goes, this hole will go on the post and use your thumb just to snap it in. Now the little finger goes straight up and down, the little metal finger. Now we've snapped it in. You're gonna shut the door. I'm gonna trim this thread off right now cause it's a little long. Get it kind of out of the way. Now I'm gonna shut my accessory tray. Now this needle gets threaded from front to back. Husqvarna Viking put a white sticker on the foot shank to help you kind of see that hole. It takes me a couple of tries now, but I eventually get it. Um, there are, uh, you know, some, the little wire thread, um, threaders, needle threaders that can help you. So if you need that, use it. So you're gonna pull this thread through and underneath that slot in the foot again. So now we're ready to sew. So I hope this has helped you with threading the machine and winding the bobbin. And if you like this video, like and subscribe and have a blessed day. Thank you so much.